Hey everybody, it's Josh Leoch. Welcome back to this week's episode. Today we're talking about how do you continue to live in your home once you put it on the market. Stay tuned. So your home has always been your sanctuary, your personal space. But now it's on the market and you're about to get a lot of foot traffic. Real estate agents and their buyers are going to be lined up at the open house and those initial showings to view every single inch of your property. All this is happening while you're just trying to live a normal life and keep things going. And it can get very stressful, especially if you have little ones. So here are five tips to start living your new, normal, hectic life while your home is on the market. All right, number one, start packing now. Packing and storing boxes in the basement of the garage is totally acceptable and we're trying to open up as much space as possible. So remember, we're selling square footage and floor space, so the bigger it feels, the more money you're going to get. Number two, sell it, donate it, or throw it away. While you're packing, for things that you don't need, plan on trying to get rid of them. My rule is if you haven't touched it in one year and it's not an heirloom or memory, then you don't need it and it's time to move on. Number three, get squeaky clean. A clean home and a well taken care of home can net you five to ten thousand dollars more in your sale. So shoot for five star hotel perfection when you're cleaning your home and focus on good cleanings in your bathrooms, kitchens, windows, floors as much as you can. Make it sparkle. Number four, maintain your privacy and your safety. People are going to go in your house and look through closets and areas that you're not normally expecting people to look. So make sure that there's nothing of any value or anything personal that you want lying around. If there's any questions or you have medications that you're concerned about, just go ahead and lock them up. Number five, involve your kids in the process. Nothing is better than having your kids be part of this process. And the easiest way to do that is through games or a reward system to help clean up the house and get it ready for those showings. You won't believe how motivated kids can get when there's a reward tied to cleaning up their rooms. So there you have it. Those are my five tips to prepare for your new hectic life living in your home that's on the market. If you have any questions on the items above or you'd like to go a little deeper into those items, please let me know by shooting me an email or certainly give me a call at any time. If there's any videos that you'd like us to record on any topics that you're interested in, certainly let me know as well and we'll get those shot for you. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day and we'll see you at the next episode.